So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how to create new style of soft body effect with using Cinema 4D R25. But guys, you can use any Cinema 4D version. See guys, I teach you how I create this type of effect. That's my soft body animation. Like this. See guys, that's simple. It's so easy tutorial guys best tutorial for beginners right see i teach you how i create this type of effect yeah okay so now guys go to on here create new project And first of all guys I take cube this one and change cube size guys this one size I like 100 yeah and y axis guys I increase height like 1000 and z1 I like 50 is good see guys that's my object so now guys make editable so click on here and select this polygon I select this one bottom and delete yeah right okay so now guys this time i take cylinder this one and change guys orientation this one and change also radius guys radius i like 5 and 50 guys segments increase i like 30 is good yeah right see okay so guys now i go to front view panel and closer see guys that's my cylinder and go to caps and fill it cap check and guys radius i like one and segments i like five yeah so closer yeah see guys that's my cylinder and go to display select god shading lines yes okay so guys now go to on front view panel and this time i use cloner so guys select this cylinder and mix all with cloner guys select this cloner and mode use grid array this one yes and count guys count with one like five more yeah and guys last one one guys this time size change size change like 35 and height this one decrease more like 75 is good right see that's my shape and now guys go to on chord this one and position y position change i like 200 is good right see guys that's my shape and next one guys duplicate this cloner press ctrl c and v and change position guys position like this that's my second one and guys again go to object and this one count i like two is good yeah see guys that's my first step right and now guys i create second one so again select this cloner and duplicate press ctrl c and v go to down like this and guys this time mode i change radial and guys change this one plane yeah and guys this one that's my radius size decrease like more like 38 is good and increase count like 7 is good right see guys that's my second one okay so guys now i increase frame like 1000 is good 1000 yes so guys go to on your yeah, object go to chord guys create rotation like this so guys r dot b rotation 0 press animation key 
and last one like 1000 frame and guys rotation like 1080 and press this animation key yeah so guys go to back and play see guys that's my rotation animation but guys see that's not correct so go to on window timeline f curve tool select all keyframes and press liner this one so again go to back and play yeah see guys that's my simple rotation guys you can also increase rotation speed so all is good so good for me and guys select this cloner and duplicate press ctrl c and v go to on down here guys this time rotation change this one r dot b only minus 1080 and press animation key yeah and go to back and play yes see guys that's my rotation okay so guys stop and select both and duplicate press ctrl c and v like this yeah and go to again back and play yeah see guys that's my simple effects right okay so next one guys i take spear and guys spear position go to on up like 500 is good and change radius guys radius i like 20 is good and yeah all is good guys segments decrease i like 12 guys create low poly guys you can hide this cube hide and hide on render yeah and see guys that's my spare this one that's my low poly okay so guys next one i apply subdivision surface this one so select this spare ball and make child with subdivision surface yeah yeah see guys that's simple right okay so next one guys that's not animate so i apply soft body tag and collider so guys select this one cloner and right click go to simulation tag and apply collider body this one yeah and guys see that's my bounce and friction friction i like five only five yes and guys apply select this collision tag apply on all cloner like this guys holding control key and drag and drop yeah right okay so guys next one select this pair this one and right click simulation tag and apply soft body but guys see that's my bounce bounce i like 50 and friction i like 5 yes and go to on soft body guys i change only stiffness this one stiffness i like only one yeah that's it guys don't change anything so now guys go to on front view panel and go to back and play yeah see guys that's really good okay so guys also select this cube this one and apply i show you see guys that's my cube and apply same collider tag select apply yeah and hide again and go to back and play yeah see guys that's my really smooth soft body animation so hide lines yeah and go to back and play okay okay see guys that's my effect but guys see that's so much too much spacing so change spacing so guys go to our mode project and see guys go to expert this one and collision margin i like 0 0.2 yeah and again go to back and play yeah much better see guys that's my really cool soft body effect see that's really smooth guys see guys that's really smooth okay so guys see that's my first step is finished it's my first step and go to back and play yeah it's good right see guys that's really smooth right okay so now guys stop this animation guys i increase more steps 
so guys i take cube and cube size change like 10 all 10 yeah and fill it check guys closer and guys radius i like one and uh, actually 0 0.5 is also good yeah okay so now guys i take again cloner select this cube and make child with cloner i select cloner and grid guys all count 10 10 and 10 and size 10 10 and 10 yeah see guys that's my cubes right and go to down yes guys you can also change this count is depending on your system configuration like this one is also good and again i take one more plane actually cube guys select this cube go to on here and change position like 10 yeah and go to on here right see guys that's my cubes okay so guys apply same select this this one that's my collider tag apply on this one cube drag and drop yeah but guys i apply this time rigid body tag on this one cloner so right click on this one cloner and simulation tag and use rigid body but guys i change only go to dynamic and see guys that's my trigger trigger i change on collision yeah and guys friction i like 10 bounce bounce like 30 yeah okay so guys all is good and now guys i take plane and change orientation and guys change size like 200 actually 100 and breadth size i like 1100 yeah and guys apply same actually go to top view panel Go to on here yeah and apply same collider tag on this plane yes right see guys okay so guys go to back and again one more time play yeah see guys that's my simple smooth soft body effect see okay so guys that's really cool and yeah beautiful guys see that's my beautiful collision effects right okay so guys that's my super smooth effect and now guys you can also increase more step like cube actually go to back select this one and copy press ctrl c and v guys change size guys also select this one cube and go to caps object caps yeah radius i like one yeah delete and select this one and duplicate so guys change size like this guys i take more cloner select this one yeah and guys change position Gu guys this time mode i use liner yeah and guys tap change this one step minus see guys that's my simple stairs i decrease yeah and increase count like 10 yeah and go to down yeah see guys that's really cool right see that's my stairs and guys also go to one plane actually cube and guys that's my short tutorial so guys little bit change and increase size like this yeah and now i select and make editable select this face and right click guys go to here inside face yeah and change position 
here and right click nice extrude go to down yes see guys that's my simple base right it's good so go to on here okay so now guys select and right click apply same collider tag and guys bounce friction like 10 yes guys now i take more plane so plane check and guys go to rotation change apply on here this side yeah and guys i increase this size plane size this one plane size increase like this yeah guys i take apply collider tag so select this one and apply on plane guys copy this plane press ctrl c and v and apply on right side yeah see guys that's my collider effect and now hide and hide on render yeah and guys lastly i apply simple wind effect so go to force and use wind and guys apply on here back side and guys rotate rotate this wind rotate like this guys 180 degree 180 yeah and go to on a i select this cube and go to on here yes okay see guys that's my basic steps right and guys go to back and play yeah it's good it's smooth guys if you want to create fast effect you can also apply on wind on here and go to down yes see guys that's my beautiful collision effects right see yeah okay so guys same apply collision on here also so right click this cube collision yeah guys bounce i like like 30 friction is good so guys go to back and i select this cube this one and little bit down go to on here yeah okay so now guys go to back and one more time play actually guys before render go to on here spare select this soft body tag that's my soft body and catch it and bake all check guys after baking create render and apply beautiful materials okay so guys my baking is finished now go to back and play so closer yeah it's really beautiful guys that's my final one guys that's beautiful yeah much better so yes see guys that's my final effects that's my final soft body animation guys you can change also friction select this one and guys go to collision friction i like 30 is also good okay so guys again go to on soft body and go to tag catch a guys clear catch a check and after bake all check okay so guys that's it my final effect is finished that's my new style of soft body animation so guys if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you